you guys it's your girl is our media if you're new here welcome to my channel and if you're not new here welcome back to my channel y'all in today's video i'm gonna be doing something a little different something i ain't never done before i'm going to be doing a hygiene haul i went to the store a few days ago it was like yesterday and i bought some new hygiene products not they may not be new new but like they're new to me you know i tried to get some things that i have never like used before but i've heard about so yes we just finna get right on into it okay <music> first thing I got is this Dove New Irritation Care Fragrance Free Nourishing Body Wash, you guys. And this is just what it looks like right here. It's the 22 Fluent Ounce. And I really, really like this. And I've been hearing good things about it. What stuck out to me is that it's fragrance free. I'm telling you guys, like... It really, I mean, it just does not have a smell. And I don't know, but that makes me feel like it's going to do what it says it's going to do. It says it's ultra moisturizing for dry, itchy skin, for sensitive skin. I don't really have sensitive skin, but I still wanted to try it. So I got it. Next thing I got is the Dove Antibacterial Bar Soap, you guys. And this is it right here this is just the four pack i have been hearing so much about this y'all i've been seeing commercials on tv about this um and actually i feel like it's really good so i don't know if you guys know but i actually work at walmart and we cannot keep this on the shelf so i was like it must be really really good and it says it protects skin from dryness yes i'm super super excited to use this okay i promise you this whole haul is not just dove products but there were so many dove products that i have never used before that i picked up so this one is the dove nourishing body care cream oil it's mango and almond butters body lotion and it says it's for dry skin and it says it has a nutri duo so deep care plus moisture lock and this is just what it looks like you guys and y'all i don't know where the heck i have been when it comes to dove like lotions body creams i don't know if you guys watched my first what's in my bag video but i have their dove like beauty cream and it's the coconut milk and that junk smells good okay but this right here this smells so freaking good you guys and like i was kind of nervous because i was like cream oil like what could that possibly be like what is the consistency of a cream oil you know what i'm saying but it looks just like a lotion but it's a little bit thicker i'm not gonna lie to you i already tried it i could not wait you guys i could not wait and it smells good and it feels good and I'm not gonna lie, this little bad boy is a little thick, okay? So if you're one of those people, you need that deep, deep, deep moisturizing lotion, I'm telling you, go ahead and pick you up some. This is the last Dove product, and it is some deodorant. I just tried out some new deodorant, but it is the Dove Indulging Ritual 48 Hour Antiperspirant Vanilla and Cocoa Butter deodorant um i kind of switch out between dove and degree deodorants but i've never tried this one and i am a very big fan of vanilla vanilla and cocoa butter mixed together you guys i think it's gonna smell good moving away from the dove products i picked up this limited edition grapefruit rose flavor mouthwash and first of all you guys already know while i was drawn to pick up this listerine because of the packaging like it's so fruity it's so girly it's so cute it's got pink 
it's a whole vibe and it says botanically inspired grapefruit flavor blend for a fresh and clean mouth that's what we all need a fresh and clean mouth okay that's really the only thing that i'd be worried about when i pick up listerine but it has zero alcohol and i've actually never been a person to pick up mouthwashes that have zero alcohol i know that it's better for you when i got my wisdom teeth removed they told me to use um mouthwash that has zero alcohol and side note i did it but i figured why not go ahead and try this one and it's grapefruit rose flavor it's actually kind of rare that you get one with a fruity flavor so i'm really excited to try this out it's probably going to be a little minute before i open it because i got to get rid of the mouthwash i already got I'm, i got like this much this much you guys the next thing that i got is some noxema classic clean moisturizing i know you guys are probably like girl you ain't never used noxema before yes i have i use it religiously actually and it's probably one of the only things i use on my face you know as far as like uh facial cleansers and stuff like that i've been using noxema ever since i was young but this is the eucalyptus classic clean and i picked it up because i love the smell of eucalyptus like um eucalyptus and spearmint products go ahead sign me up i already know that i like it i love the candles when they have it and this smells so good y'all I don't know if you ever smell Noxema, but it has a very distinct smell. And the eucalyptus, I don't know, it kind of dresses that smell up a little bit. The next thing I got, I was super, super excited to pick up, was one of the Native Body Washes. First of all, can we talk about the packaging? Like, whoa, period. This is super cute. It just looks so modern and sleek. And I don't know, it just makes me feel like classy it makes me feel like a grown woman yes a body wash makes me feel like a grown woman a body wash does have the potential to make you feel like a grown woman but anyways it's coconut and vanilla and it's sulfate free paraben free dye free something else free i can't pronounce it truth be told i don't understand why i waited so long to pick this up because those are the things that i look for sometimes when i pick up my hair products so it's probably good if it's in my skincare products as well because some of those things are actually really harmful to you i'm not lying to you guys when i say this smells good y'all you guys know i love vanilla i probably say it in just about every skincare Bath and Body Works video that I do, vanilla smells so good and coconut too. Even though I don't like to eat coconut, I love the smell of it. And wow, this smells so good. I wanted to get more of them, but I ain't got the coins like that. So I didn't. It also has like on the back, this little chart and it has ingredients that it's made up with and what it does for you. So like it has like citric acid, food grade acid for pH balance, all this stuff. And I think that is so helpful, yes. The next thing I got is this Degree Maximum Recovery Massage Bar. Y'all, first off, it's Epsom salt plus eucalyptus extract. I don't know why I picked this up, but first of all, I love the design, I love the packaging, and I, really do actually like degree deodorant um i've used degree for years it says that the massage bar helps you with muscle reset energy recharge refreshing hydration and cleans away germs and bacteria i need all that okay i need all that i work i go to an internship i need my energy to be recharged so i am super excited to try this for you guys the next thing i picked up was another degree product and it is the epsom salt muscle soak but this one is lavender extract and electrolytes i am a person who takes bubble baths from time to time i take them because i be stressed out i take them because i be trying to practice self-care so yes i love using epsom salt i normally use the dr teal's epsom salt y'all i swear by dr teal's epsom salt but i said that i'm gonna try some things that i haven't tried before so this is the one that i picked up 
and it says it eases muscle aches, relaxes the body, de-stresses the mind, and recharges energy. Like I said, you guys, I need all that, and I feel like you guys do too. The next thing I got is some EOS Shave Better Shave Cream. This isn't necessarily a new product, but it's new to me. I've never tried it before, and it says that it has 24-hour moisture. That's good. Shea oil and shea butter. Shave plus in shower lotion. So it's kind of like works as a dual product. You can do two things. And it says it works wet and it works dry. So I'm very excited to try this. This thing is making some big, big claims, okay? Scent is Vanilla Bliss. The packaging is also really, really cute. It does remind me of something very modern, kind of like the native packaging and the color and it also has like on the back like some different like notes about what ingredients are used it has soothing aloe and they said that's supposed to condition and nourish your skin i wanted to try the eos body lotion but walmart was out it might just be my walmart but i didn't see it so yeah let me know if you guys have tried that too next thing i picked up was by olay and it is their rinse off body conditioner this is the packaging the packaging is really really cute it's all sparkly and stuff like that and it just it's so girly i know you guys are probably thinking girl why do you need a rinse off conditioner for your body because i use rinse off conditioner for my hair so why not use it for my body i just honestly like i said was just trying to try some new stuff but it says it has b3 plus shea butter it comes in an eight fluid ounce and it says that it is made with shea butter and vitamin b3 complex and it infuses skin with concentrated moisture to help stop dry skin before it starts the next thing i got was this stair breath dentist formulated fresh breath toothpaste and it says it freshens breath for 24 hours made for anti-cavities anti-tartar with soothing aloe vera and this is in the scent mild mint i have been hearing so much about this toothpaste and the uh, mouthwash i didn't get the mouthwash because i said i'm gonna see how the toothpaste do it if the toothpaste do well then you already know your girl gonna go and she gonna get that mouthwash okay there wasn't that many like options for the toothpaste but there are like several options for the mouthwash i also picked up some new razors um these are the sensitive kind and it comes with three of them i just looked for some that were not too pricey but some ones that also didn't look like they would be harmful to my skin and last but not least i got some loofahs um because you're supposed to change out your loofahs like at least every four weeks so that's what i do and these were just two dollars so yeah they didn't have any cuter colors than this so that's why i got these little you know yeah colors but yeah you guys okay you guys so that is the end of the video that was everything that i purchased from my walmart hygiene haul if i mentioned any products in this video that you've already tried comment down below on how they're working for you and if you know some that i didn't mention also comment those down below as well because although this was the first hygiene haul that i filmed it will not be the last so i'm eager to know what you guys are using if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and turn the post notification bell on so that you'll be notified about when i make my next video bye you guys